hey guys just before the video begins all i want to say is don't forget to like subscribe and also don't forget to follow me on twitch i always stream at 10 a.m cst monday through friday so please give me a follow and don't forget to follow the rest of my socials okay i'll see you guys later enjoy the video Bye bye oh um i'm sorry um sorry i i, I didn't mean to scare you I, I just didn't think anyone would find me all the way up here I'm really trying not to be seen, and you surprised me, and I- No, 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 wait, 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 don't, please, don't leave. You can't tell anyone that I'm here. No! I'm not an assassin! I'm just hiding in this out-of-the-way room, wearing foreign clothes, in the dark. Okay. Yes, I realize this is kind of suspicious, but I swear, I'm not here to hurt anyone. I'm, um, <sighs> I'm sort of hiding from my betrothed. Well, you would be too if you were in my position. I've never seen her before, and now I have to greet her in front of a hundred nobles and officers of state and other important people? And they're all going to be staring at me because I'm supposed to be the king of this kingdom soon. Ah, oh, shoot. Yes, I'm the prince of the southern land. Big whoop, huh? <sighs> I'm sorry, I should be more polite. It's just been a rough couple days. With what, with all the travels, and now I have to get married to someone I've never met. It's a lot for one man to handle. I know I can't hide out here for long. I have a duty to my kingdom to make sure this goes well. And to yours now, I suppose. I just wanted some peace and quiet for a bit before my whole life turns upside down. But I shouldn't be dumping this all on you. It's not my place. I mean, we just met. And here I am spilling my whole life story. Highly inappropriate for a crown prince, if you ask me. I guess I'm just not myself right now. But hey, you work for the princess, don't you? Wearing her colors. So you're hiding from your duties as well, too, huh? Yeah, no, I understand. I don't like the big royal functions either. And I'm sure the castle must be swarming with people and noises right now. <sighs> well, I won't tell anyone if you don't. <laughs> okay, deal. Can I ask you what she's like? The princess? Sorry, if if you don't want to talk. Oh, no, you don't have to worry about that. I know I'm supposed to be the prince and all that, but I don't like standing on ceremony. You can just call me Matthew. It's not like there's anyone around to enforce etiquette right now. It's nice to meet you, too. Thank you for not dragging me back out there. Yeah, I suppose. Let's hope your highness isn't too upset with my lateness. Is she? Uh, the kind of person that gets upset easily? Good to hear. I spend so much time worrying about what she might be like. I mean, what if she's cruel or selfish or stupid? Not a lot of nobles are genuinely good people, you know? I don't know how this kingdom would be any different. Yeah, I guess you would know, huh? Wouldn't you? You probably spent a lot of time dealing with stuck-up nobility. Oh, not that the princess is that. I, I mean, I wouldn't know. I haven't met her. Sorry. I probably shouldn't be talking about the beer boss like that, huh? Ugh. 
Yeah, I'm pretty nervous. Is that is that obvious? I mean, I am afraid. I won't like her. But I think I'm more even more afraid that she won't like me. I'm not a great example of a prince, you know. I get scared real easily. I talk too much. I don't do well in front of crowds. And I like chess and poetry more than sword play or hunting and... <sighs> Sorry. I didn't mean to ramble. Like I, I said, I'm just nervous. I'll probably mess up everything I'm supposed to say in front of her and pass out or something. I know, but I only get one chance at this. What if I make such a bad impression that she doesn't even want to do anything with me? I don't know. My best idea was to hide up here until I calm down. But I just keep going in circles. There's no real way you can prepare to meet your future wife. Not that I thought of it. Practice. What, like pretend you're her? You think that would help me? Well, I guess it couldn't hurt. It might keep me from stumbling over my words anyway. Okay. Let's practice. Yeah, I'm supposed to meet her in the Great Hall. I've probably missed the scheduled time by now, but... Oh well. Can't change that. Can't do much about the nobles that'll be watching us, either, but... Right, sorry. Focus. Deep breaths. So? The whole thing's pretty simple, in theory. She'll be standing at the edge of the hallway with her court... And once they announce me, I just have to go walk up to her. That's you, your temporary highness. <laughs> now, I bow, and you curtsy, and I take your hand in mine. Sorry, this part uh, makes me nervous. So I kiss your hand, and then, um, talk? You know, you'll ask me how the journey was, and I'll lie about it because it was terrible. And I'll ask you how you are, and you'll probably lie to me too. And then... God, I don't know. What should we say? How do I get her to like me? Compliments? You're right. That's smart. But how do I compliment her when we've never met? What can I like about her when I don't even know her? I suppose you can tell a lot by someone from their appearance, if you pay attention. I just don't feel like I'm any good at that. Okay, I'll give it a try on you. Um... Your radiance truly outshines the morning dawn, your highness. Yeah, that does sound fake. Uh, let me try again. You, uh... You have beautiful eyes, you know? Yeah, I mean it. They're all soft and kind. And when the lights hit them... All the different shades come out. I could look at them for a while, I think. Especially when you smile like that. It's cute. Oh no. I made you blush? That's not good. I should make her blush, shouldn't I? Oh, really? I did alright? No, you did too. You should pretend to be a princess more often. You're pretty good at it. Or maybe not, actually. I don't know if your kingdom will see that as treason. <laughs> I do feel a lot better now, at least. Yeah, it did help. I mean, I'm still nervous, but 
At least I know I have a friend around here. That is, if you do want to be friends. Really? I, I mean, yes. Uh, I would love to be your friend. And since you work for the princess, I'll be able to see you again. Maybe we can... <sighs> Wait a minute. Oh, no. I can't believe it. I've been talking to you for so long, and I've never asked for your name. I am so sorry. I'm making a total fool out of myself. Miss Sweet, but I still feel terrible. I'll find a way to make it up to you. Somehow. I promise. Well, in the meantime, would you give this foolish prince the pleasure of an introduction? That's lovely. Just as pretty as your eyes, and you have the same first name as the princess. That's incredible. What are the chances? <laughs> uh, oh. Oh. H how, um. H how much in trouble am I right now? Well, I, I said some pretty, um, negative things about you and your kingdom's ability. <sighs> and I, I don't know. I mean, now you see me all awkward and nervous and all a little sweaty and, oh, God, it's you, you're a uh, I've totally messed this, messed this up. How, how did I not realize? Um. Oh. Oh, oh, um. Does that mean you're not mad at me? You were hiding from me. Really? I can't believe it. I thought I was the only one who was this nervous, but, but you're not scary at all. You're sweet and witty and pretty funny. I really like talking with you. Why would you be nervous? Touche. Maybe we're not a bad match at all. Would you... want to keep talking? Uh, get to know each other a little bit better, now that I know who you are? Yeah, we should probably head back upstairs to the ceremony anyway. Our poor parents are going to wonder if we ran away. And, um... Maybe afterwards, if you want to, you could kiss me again? That was my first, you know. No, no it's it's okay. I I liked it, really. I, I just, it got me to stop panic, didn't it? We'll see, huh? All right. I promise I'll do my best to earn one, if that's what it takes. Can I hold your hand now, again, since they're not sweaty anymore? I promise. Go on, your highness. I'll follow your lead. And, uh, thank you to my channel members. Riverwood, Elilai D.E., Sin, and the Blue Rose. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye-bye, guys.